The Blight had been unleashed on Ferelden. Darkspawn poured out of the wilds, clashing against the army at the ruins of Ostagar. The battle was a disaster. King Kaelin died on the field with his men, betrayed by his most trusted general. Unopposed, the Horde marched on the village of Lothering. The village burned, and many innocents were slaughtered. The Champion's family barely escaped in time. I think that's all of them. For the moment, make us save us. We've lost it all. Everything your father and I built. Y'all, welcome to Dragon Age 2. That's right, we are going to be going through this game together. I am actually a huge fan of DA2. Um, but this time around, instead of doing an immersive let's play like I've done with DAI and uh, kind of sort of did with DAO, uh, I wanted to do kind of like a casual hybrid immersive, non-immersive let's play so we can kind of just play it together um but a lot of the stuff will be answered in character and all of that good stuff now i do as you probably can already tell have a wide variety of mods in uh, including some that you haven't seen yet uh that'll kind of start to unfold but as a heads up i do have the kirkwall expanded mod in which i'm very excited to do a full playthrough with as well as a mod called twinception which means both of the twins will survive uh this prologue encounter and I just wanted to make you aware of that ahead of time um I've never played with that mod before I am so so excited to see what happens when we have both Bethany and Carver uh throughout the course of the game so with that being said um this will be a rogue hawk Fenris Mance uh and she gonna be sassy uh I don't know about you but my favorite kind of hawk is um is the sarcastic asshole hawk. <laughs> so um we're gonna go with this one at least we're alive. That's no small feat. Yes. You're right. We should have run sooner. Why did we wait so long? Why are you looking at us? We've been running since Ostagar. Yes, yes we have, which means we should probably keep going. Not to interrupt, but the Blight's not going to wait while we stand here pointing fingers. Please, listen to your sister. Yeah, you should. Then let's go. Lead on. Why? Why? Why, do, why does Hawk always have to lead? Is it because she's the oldest? Probably. I mean, that, that would definitely be that. Okay. So, just to get my bearings, we got this. How's the... Oh! Ooh! I forgot I get one of each of these to start. Uh, lots of modded weapons. I'm going to get, when we get back home, um, I'm going to get a dual set of, I think that's my favorite uh, when I play. The Talon of the Wood. Uh, I like this one a lot. Um, this one's also really cool, the Night Whisper. I like that one too. We'll see how we feel as we go on. Uh, but because Bethany and Carver are both surviving, I can give both of them good weapons. Uh, here, take take that. Oh, uh, like it just doesn't look right on him. So take that for now. Okay. All right. So first things first. I keep forgetting you can do like it does both. It's kind of like it's not boring. No, Hawk. What is boring though? Okay, is it R? Yeah, R for auto combat. Okay, it's been a bit. Who <laughs> wants like remember how to do this? Go down. Anybody else? That's a lot of dead people. Thank you. Okay, dead refugee. Take all that. I'm. Oh, we're also a rogue, so we can automatically pick locks. Okay. I have a separate mod for when I play as a mage. So I don't think, I don't actually think Hawk has access to that. Anyways, let's do, I'm gonna up our crit and our damage. Also, um, so yes, but I, I would like to put, oh, do I wanna, you know what? Let's do this for now. Good, excellent. 
what is this one? Oh yeah apparently i already had this so this is the um i can just leave that well can i just auto activate that now i could just leave you here it's to uh block bash toggle yeah i mean she's a rogue i don't think that'll matter too much uh no i wanted this tree to start i love the dual wielding rogue combat in this game i am not actually i love the combat in this game it's probably my favorite out of all the dragon age games i'm not gonna lie um but there is something like extra delicious about the rogue like especially like that double backstab that we'll see eventually and stuff the animations are insanely good also i really like the mage combat where like if a baddie gets too close you end up using your staff against them like those oh those are good i love them so much wait what where are we going away from here away from the dark spawn yes. where else and then where i don't know we can't just wander aimlessly why not like why can't we why can't we just be a roving band of siblings and their mother who wander aimlessly everywhere so long as we wander aimlessly away from the horde i'm happy we can go to Kirkwall. We could. Well, that wouldn't be my first choice. There's a lot of Templars in Kirkwall, Mother. I know that. But we still have family there. And an estate. Uh-huh. <sighs> then we need to get to Guarin and take ship. If we survive that long, I'll just be happy to get out of here. Now we fight! Okay. This, this. Now what do I, I got, got here? This. Yes, that's so good. No, give me more combat. <laughs> Yay, Aveline. Oh, no. She's so badass. Every time, so badass. You will not have him. Oh, it's so good. They will not have you. Not while I breathe. Okay, girl, you gonna go help now? Eh? Let's go this way. Oh, wait. Haunt. Can you go finish him? Thank you. And this. Get back. What about you? Oh. That, that like... Disappear, reappear. Stop squirming, Top tier. Wesley. You'll make it worse. Apostate, keep your distance. Well, the Maker has a sense of humor. Huh. Darkspawn and now a Templar. I thought they all abandoned Lothering. The spawn are clear in their intent, but a mage is always unknown. The order dictates. Wesley. That woman is an apostate. The order dictates. I love how Hawk here just like gets right in his they face. Saved us. The maker understands. The maker better be understanding. Of course. Yeah. I am Aveline Valen. This is my husband, Sir Wesley. We can hate each other when we're safe from the horde. You know, that's a great idea. Hundred hundred percent. Why are you out here though? A strange time to be hunting apostates. His fellows left with the Chantry priests. I was traveling to Denerim on business for the Order, but I had to turn south when I heard of Ostagar. Bad luck and judgment brought us together here before the attack. The nice Templar has been convinced to postpone his hunt for illegal mages. <laughs> so let's not dwell upon it, shall we? That's uh, probably Wise for the best. Girl. I don't like... <laughs> the way she's like let's move this conversation along can you all be trusted you're quick to offer your allegiance another blade between us and the darkspawn yes please so long as the horde is their first concern my duty is clear but that is for another day if we are granted that opportunity we will be fine we all will uh-huh we better be how did you survive the horde i didn't think anybody could survive it for a while, it looked like we were the only ones to escape the Darkspawn. We aren't free of them yet. Just like at Ostagar, this is just the start. You were there. Yes, I see it now. Third Company, under Captain Varrell. Then you saw how the whole of the army was defeated. 
We fell to betrayal, not the Darkspawn. This arm of the Horde will not have the same advantage. One can only hope, given everything that's already happened. So, your husband, gentle for a mage hunter, or...? The wrath of the Templars is terrible indeed. More so their wives. But as long as there is a greater danger, you and I have an accord. Thank you, Wesley. For now, we move with you. North is cut off. We barely escaped the main body of the Horde. Then we're trapped. The wilds are to the south. That's no way out. If the options are south or die, I'll take my chances with south. All right, we should have. Oh, good. Carver hates us still. I, I was worried that Carver would be happy to see us. Anything back there? Yeah, see? You don't want to leave loot behind. Oh my goodness. Hawk, we almost left it behind. Thank you. Okay, let's see. Um, I actually don't mind the way the system auto levels up like Bethany and Carver. Honestly, I don't mind the way the system auto levels in general. Let's do this. And that. They kind of look Time like they kind of look like they're dancing mistake. out in the distance. Like they really and truly do. Like, <laughs> the way they were like waving their swords and stuff. I don't know why it amuses me. Okay, can I loot them first though? Cause they got stuff in their oh backpack up. I forgot I had a mod for that. So apparently I just got all my backpack upgrades already. Whoops. You? you? No, this. Thank you. Run while you can. Why are you up front? You are a mage. You are squishy. That's enough. Uh, this. This. Uh, now you. You got that. Like, Carver. You're young. Use those young legs. Say, oh, no, I'll do it, I guess. Can I get that? Carver, you got that? What about the dangers of magic? We got that. Go down. Okay. Of course we did. Of course we did what? Killed them all? I mean, yes. Was there was there ever a question? I don't think so. Okay. I think that's everyone. I think we looted everything. Um, let me see. Is there? So I have this. I think we'll be fine for now with what she has. But I do like there's more stuff for that mod coming when we get back to the house. Um, and then I also have like the DLC stuff and everything. Apparently I have m multiple backpack things. So is my backpack like, yeah, it's fully upgraded. <gasps> nice. Two oh. arms. Uh, ah. You. No. <laughs> How do you know their name? Bethany. They're dark spawn. Do they actually have names? Like, I'm actually kind of curious about that. Let's finish this. Okay. Sure. Ooh, good hit. Well, next. Yes. Quickly, before they regroup. They're we not must press towards the wilds. Okay. I'm moving as fast as my little legs can carry me. Apparently I there are like a million spots for that. That should do it. Okay. Uh this. And then you don't get XP for this stuff, right? Like I feel so weird not picking it up. Um, but at the same time, once again, no XP for it. Auto. 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 Okay. Uh what do you want today, Hulk? Um, strength increases damage and attack value for warriors. For all classes, increases fortitude. Right. Resist knock. I would like to put some into strength. Um, dex is obviously fantastic. Magic for all classes. It increases magical resistance, which absorbs. Or, 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 okay. Right. Cunning. Rogue's aptitude for like, picking locks. We would like that. And we're going to put in some more to stamina. Um, let's do 
Yeah, let's do this next. Okay. Good. Uh, quick save, because you can never be too careful. And then, am I going the right way? Yes. Okay. Now we're going to see how this all works with the twin. You know what? Let's just do a hard save here just to be safe, because I am, like, super curious how all this works with the twins. Um, so we'll see in a minute. Oh, that's how they did it. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Eh? Eh? Victory. Okay. Was it? Where's the rest of them? Right there. Okay. You. Okay. Oh, I think that's all of them there. Now we fight. Another. Ha! Han, there's more here. Eh, there. How about you? Now, there's oh. no end to them. Okay, I really like the way that this is working out. What an introduction. I haven't seen you in so long, girl. How you been? Well, well. What have we here? It used to be we never got visitors to the wilds, but now it seems they arrive in hordes. Yeah, imagine that. Must be the time of year or something like that. That's a nice trick. Impressive. Where'd you learn how to turn into a dragon? Perhaps I am a dragon. Ooh. If so, count yourself lucky. The smell of burning darkspawn does nothing for the appetite. If you wish to flee the darkspawn, you should know you are heading in the wrong direction. So you're just going to leave us here? Can I not? I spotted the most curious sight. A mighty ogre vanquished. Who could perform such a feat? But now my curiosity is sated and you are safe for the moment. Is that not enough? I mean, it is, but what if I want to be a dragon too? Like, then what happens? Do you have like, turning people into dragon classes or anything? You could show me that trick of yours. That looks useful. <laughs> if only a clever tongue was all one needed. Tell me, clever child, how do you intend to outrun the Blight? We need to get to Kirkwall, in the Free Marches. Kirkwall? My, but that is quite the voyage you plan. Your king will not miss you, hmm? I don't, I don't think my king has much of an opinion these days, you know what I mean? I'm sure he'll miss his life more. <laughs> oh, you I like. Hurtled into the chaos, you fight, and the world will shake before you. Is it fate or chance? I can never decide. It appears fortune smiles on us both today. I may be able to help you yet. 
There has to be a catch. Like somebody that can turn into a dragon can't just like be like, yes, I will help you without there being a catch. Like there has to be. There must be a catch. <laughs> there is always a catch. Life is a catch. I suggest you catch it while you can. Should we even trust her? I don't know. We don't even know what she is. I know what she is. What is the she? The Witch of the Wilds. Oh. Some call me that. Also Flemeth. Asha Bellinar, an old hag who talks too much. <laughs> Does it matter? I offer you this. I will get your group past the Horde in exchange for a simple delivery to a place not far out of your way. Would you do this for a Witch of the Wilds? Um, I say yes, but I'm not here by myself. So what does the rest of you think? Should we trust her? Wesley is injured. We'll never escape the Darkspawn. If you need to, leave me behind. No. I said I would drag you out if I had to, and I meant it. Okay. Then, uh, yes, we're in agreement. Let's roll. We don't have much choice. We never do. There is a clan of Dalish elves near the city of Kirkwall. Deliver this amulet to their keeper, Marathari. Do as she asks with it. And any debt between us is paid in full. Before I take you anywhere, however, there is another matter. No, leave him alone. What has been done to your man is within his blood already. You lie! She's right, Aveline. I can feel the corruption inside me. Um, I like it that you have the option to ask what corruption, but I feel like, I feel like if you escaped loitering, you know what the blight is and you've seen the dark spawn, you know what the corruption is. This sounds awful, by the way. This corruption is the permanent sort, I take it. The only cure I know of is to become a Grey Warden. And they all died at Ostagar. Not all, but the last are now beyond your reach. Aveline, listen to me. You can't ask me this. I won't. Please. The corruption is a slow death. I can't. Poor Aveline. This is heartbreaking. Um, like, I've done it. I, I think I've literally done all three options here. I normally think that the it's up to you, like... On one hand, the I'll do it is nice, but you're a stranger. If this was like Hawk Act 2 or Act 3, I think doing it for Aveline or offering to would be really nice. But the whole like, at this point, we don't know each other. I don't have the right to make decisions for you kind of thing. You know, let's leave it up to her. He's your husband, Aveline. I can't decide his fate. Be strong, my love. The music here is also like gut wrenching. Without an end, there can be no peace. It gets no easier. Your struggles have only just begun. Flemeth! I thought that might interest you. You expect me to believe a myth swooped out of the wild to save the champion? Oh, come now, Seeker. Do I need to recite the tale of the Warden as well? Yes. No. Perhaps I shouldn't be surprised to hear of her involvement. I liked my version better, too. What else aren't you telling me, then? Did she send someone with the champion? In a matter of speaking. So it's true. 
Continue. But if you tell me they all flew to Kirkwall on a dragon... Nothing so fanciful, I assure you. I don't the know. Witch kept her Kinda word feels that fanciful. and got them to Guaran, where they took ship. They sailed north across the waking sea, lashed by terrible storms. Two weeks they spent in that dark hold, packed in with the fearful and the desperate. And then they saw it. Kirkwall, the city of chains. Long ago it was part of the Imperium, slaves coming from far and wide to work the quarries. Now, it's a free city, but I use the word loosely. Sail through those black cliffs and you'll see what the slaves of old saw. The gallows, welcoming you. That's where their ship landed, with all the rest. So far, um, having both twins just is feeling so good. And I don't actually, I don't feel like I've noticed that it shouldn't be this way, which makes me very, very excited, um, all things considered. By the way, uh, as a heads up, the mod list will be linked in the description of each of the episodes. So if you want to see what mods I'm using, feel free to check them out there. I always loved the introduction of Kirkwall. Like, you get the enormity of the city and, like, just how heavy it feels, you know? They're not letting oh anyone my... into the city. <laughs> what? You see Bethany that can't be. and Carver. It's true. No. Look at them all. <gasps> no. Okay, hold on. Okay, for the first time, it's not fitting, but it's so good. That's so good. I love They're it. They're Ferelden's just like us, fleeing for their lives. And they would throw us all back to the wolves. Unbelievable. It's... T how is it unbelievable? It's totally believable. I'm only surprised they let us dock. We need to find Gamlin. Our family has always been highly regarded in Kirkwall. He can do something, I'm sure of it. Let's hope he received your letter. The guards seem to be reporting to that man. Perhaps we should speak to him. <laughs> 